This is uh, the mighty 690, 690 AM. It's a 77 kilowatt border blaster out of Tijuana. And of course, I'm in Los Angeles. And looks like they're using a directional array and pointing it right at us. Cause it, is, it is strong up here. And they've been, or they've started playing music. I've sort of heard that, uh, or read that maybe they were some kind of Chinese operative station or something like that, which 77 kilowatts, somebody's got to be funding all of that electricity. I wonder what uh, power rates are like in Mexico compared to California or the United States. Anyway, um, let's, let's resurrect this thing, see if we can listen to, uh, is it XEMM, I think is the call sign. I'd have to look it up. Now, this is not the same station that we were picking up on a backpacking trip. That one was way better. This one is playing like uh, what I would consider the Radio Disney music, all the like Katy Perry type pop stuff. And we'll we'll go through a bunch of samples, but we do have a station we can pick up in L.A. again playing music. They uh, don't play the radio edits either. Uh, string of F-bombs, no problem. We're rolling clean. All right. Let's put on the gloves and get ready to finger this dirty thing. GE clock radio. What do we think of the looks of this? Does this look... I mean, yeah, it's dirty and in bad shape, but it's definitely a different design. Has a record player input, has a coffee maker output, and it looks like... like the guts are floating around at least the clock part so it's got a hole in it here do we have a model number on this oh we do it's a model 912 standard five tube tube assortment for your dining pleasure How do we see if we can make working again and pick up our new music station that's probably only playing music until they can find some type of worthless propaganda to put on there that no one will listen to. I gotta say that is sort of heavy duty for a five tube radio. All metal chassis. Almost reminds me of one of the first resurrections I did. I found one of these out at my friend's mining camp in the mine dump. And it was, it had been sitting outside for about 40 years and I got it to work. Small bar antenna. Let 
Yeah, remarkably heavy duty. So I'm going to pull the chassis and we'll get in close here and inspect it before we plug it in. All right, shaky time. I found the piece of plastic that broke that was missing from here. You could probably glue that back together except the knobs are missing off the clock. I do like how this plugs in. This is the analysis part of the video. So interesting this has two I was going to say that these GE sets General Electric 5 tube radios are notorious for bad IF transformers. Silver mica disease the you know we've we've dealt with that in several videos on this channel. And this is interesting because this has two replacement, I believe those are replacement IF transformers, Miller. They look like they've been in there for quite a long time too. Can you imagine a customer brings this in for repair and you, you call them up to get authorization to replace the IF transformers? Yeah, it'll be... $35, $40 to replace, I don't know, how much would that have cost back in the 60s? $20, bucks, $25 parts and labor to install the... So look at this gimmicky thing, the, the light moves. Well, oh boy is that stiff. Look at this. Look at the way this is built. That's the oscillator coil. This thing is like a cut above for GE. Looks like it has all GE tubes in it. See, GE, 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 GE. But why does it have those Miller transformers? It's got unpluggable speaker, unpluggable clock. So check this out. You look at this impressive metal can and you're like, ooh, wow, that's a cut above. And then you open it and it's got one of the crappiest baked circuit boards you've ever seen in it. Look at this. It almost looks like these IF transformers are in sockets. Look at that. Yeah, I would say, I mean, it is GE, but I would say that's been replaced. Guitar lover's capacitor. Baked. Wow. Just wow. Let's uh, take the capacitor tester and check this. Electrolytic right here. God, what do you even think about this design? It is not without its hours of use, that's for damn sure. So we got two sections in this. This one is dead. This one here is even worse. Dead. So this thing, it's going to hum. That thing is baked, dried out. Is that like the original... Double fifty at one fifty. Nothing but the best. 
Because this thing's just kind of garbage. And I just noticed that the reason why the clock was loose is because all the... You could glue it back together, but you know, it, at what point, you know? Um, I'm just going to plug it in. Never do this if it's a radio you care about or if you care about safety. Always use a dim bulb and an isolation transformer. There's the disclaimer. All right, about the worst that could happen here is you'll blow the 35W4 apart. Well, it is make no noise. Oh, oh, oh. It is make noise. Clock is dead, though. Oh, yes. Listen to that bass. Let's get some, man, is this stiff. This needs to be lubed bad. This thing is like f full of dry grease. It's so frozen. It's, uh, sounds like there's some activity there. Let's get some filter capacitors and just tack them in and see what happens. We got a couple filters tacked in here. 15,000 at 250 for the primary filter and... Uh, 2200 at 250 for the secondary filter. Here we go. Doesn't hurt to go up, up a little bit on your capacity or filter capacitors. You really don't want to go down, but it doesn't hurt to go up a little bit. Just a little bit. You don't want to you don't want to be overkill or anything, but let's see what happens. It's food friendly and it's the purpose comes out from the crowd since its creation in 1870. Result, Clayton Kershaw so far in this season, in six starts, he is 5-1, a 189 ERA. He has held opponents to a 175 batting average. He has struck out 41, walked only five, and now okay, what has is that many noise? wins. That was sort of unsettling. I think it needs oil. The very first inning, he goes one, two, three in the first. Also, do you want to live well without drowning in debt? No. Top of the fourth, we go. 66, 800, 200. The uh, internal agencies ask the question without the subject knowing. Very poor performance. Belongs in the parts drawer. What time?
Thanks for them. This is Real Estate Today, the number one real estate show in America. Very well. Yep. Welcome to. Okay, so this is that. Great, and on today's show, we're looking. Let's go down to the next one here. How to have more fun? <laughs> Left side, so we'll do it again. Adrian Hauser, another one of their uh, starting pitchers who's been on the injured list with the... Okay, so it's right below this. The batter is he's faced so far in this game, but he's trailing 2 nothing. On a recurring basis, I I love that. You don't have a credit card that offers you access to your credit score. So there's two stations there that this thing just is not hearing. Nothing. Not even there. I mean, the music station should be right here. Stand by. That's cranked all the way down. So what I want to do is loosen that up a little bit, bring this down. No? I want to bring that, reduce the capacitance here so I can increase the capacitance here. So then I should have to bring this closed. Maybe that's too much. Yeah, there we go. There we go. We got him now. See, now I have some adjustment range here. I loosened this up, which allowed me to close this so there's more capacitance here to remove capacitance here because I had this one cranked all the way down and it wasn't enough. Well, hello, where did you go? Just like... I'm 
Oh boy. Yeah, this is not the right way. But I mean, still listen. It's no freaking contest. I'm gonna try and move it so the antennas are the same thing. This almost seems like these IF transformers are bad again. Yeah, I'm going to say that these are bad. I silver mica disease the capacitors are no longer making good connection inside there. I mean it's a really stupid design. The thing is with those mica capacitors, those mica wafers, they are super stable that are in these you know, they are extremely stable capacitors when they work right. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to spend five bucks a piece to get capacitors that stable to put on the bottom. But yeah, I done murdered it. Unfortunately, you can't just go to the electronics store today and buy new ones of these. There we go. Fixed. Batting order he yeah. hasn't quite, quite gotten there yet. Ah. Part. Part spin. The music they play is like what Radio Disney used to play, maybe a little bit more grown up. Maybe instead of targeted towards 5 to 7, this is targeted towards 13 to 15. I don't know, it's not really adult contemporary and it's it's not really teeny bop. It's sort of, I don't know what to think of their musical selection. I, I'm sure it's just temporary. But they are strong here. This is... Yes, bigger capacitors. Bigger is better. Get the station ID here. I like the uh, Whitney Houston more cocaine please version. 
presenting. Sir Fail, it's still had a hearing and it was still debated. That is not the Holy crap, my ears are ringing so now. Yes, Holy crap. Yes, that is correct. But so, being a chair of a committee 